So hello everybody, it is Monday, so it's time for another Power BI video. This time it's Power Query. And the, the trick I'm going to show you is something that you taught me on the comment box. Here's the thing, if you watch my videos, make sure you check the comment box. There are gold in there, gold nuggets for sure. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. I'm going to show you a quick way to change data types in M, using M, okay? So I'm going to show you when you need to use M and a very quick way to do it. So here's the thing. Scenario. This is a Northman data set. Here we have a customer table. Let's say that the customer table comes from different systems. And because it comes from different systems, there is a risk that the same customer ID would be used for different customers. So what we want to do is when, when we, we have imported all our customers in one table, I want to create a unique or another column where I know that it is unique. So to do that, we would go and create an index number, for example. And this will create a number from zero to mm. And then we're going to concatenate customer ID. So we go to add column, custom column. And we're going to concatenate customer ID with our newly created index number. And this is customer ID two. Horrible name, but bear with me. Okay, so this is going to fail. I'm going to show you why. So it says error. And the reason why it says error, you can click here and it will tell you. But I know already it's because index is being stored as a number. And it says here, we cannot apply, we cannot concatenate text and number. It has to be both text. So there are two ways to solve this. You can go up here and change index to number to text, or you can do it here on the fly. I recommend you to do data types on the fly or what well, data types should be done as late as possible. But if you have to, in this case, do it on the fly. So you don't have to create a step for that. Okay. And how do you do it on the fly? Well, here's the thing. And this is what you saw me struggling with. And you actually helped with a super good trick. There are like a hundred functions to fix that. And there, there is, I never remember, was it, was it number to text or was it number from text from number or how it is? So what I do is I go to Google and I ask when I don't know something and I just write, okay, was it text from number Power Query? And then normally, the Microsoft documentation shows up and it shows me, okay, you have two options, text from and number to text. I've never paid attention to this text from. So I use number to text. But the thing with number to text is if you use number to text, you have to remember what the other versions of it are for how do you convert uh, text to number? How do you convert date to number, if you want to have the serial numbers, I've done it recently. How do you convert? Well, this is where the fantastic trick comes along. Use whatever from. Let me show you. So instead of using, trying to remember, was, was it number two text or was it text from number or what was it? You say, what do I want my column to be formatted as? text. In this case, text, right? And then you write from and Power Query will figure out what from is. You don't have to tell him. You don't have to tell, hey, that is number converted to text. No. Okay. Let's say that we were wanting to convert it to date. So you just write here date from. Let's say that you wanted to convert it to number that it was text and you wanted to have number, you write number from, date from, time from, duration from, text from, from. And that's it. That's all you need to know. I use it all the time and it is so, 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 so useful. So thank you very much. I'm so sorry that I don't, I think it was David that showed me the trick. I don't remember, but thank you. Thank you, thank you. And you see, it is very, very useful. And it's just so quick. So hope this trick helps you convert in very, very quickly data types using M. Okay. I'll see you again in the next video. Until then, as always, take care. Bye-bye.